vitamin K reduces internal bleeding, helps the blood to coagulate well and combines with calcium to build strong bones. Vitamin K can help reduce bleeding in some cases, such as liver disease, malabsorption or antibiotics for long periods. The main role of vitamin K is to help the blood clotting process work well and to limit the amount of blood lost when injured. If the body is deficient in vitamin K, your blood will not be able to coagulate and this can lead to death. Vitamin K can also be combined with calcium to help keep bones strong. Vitamin K deficiency can cause osteoporosis. In addition, vitamin K can help prevent kidney stones. Because of their diet, vegetarians are people who consume large amounts of vitamin K so they do not get it. Vitamin K is also used to treat skin lesions. Acute fibrosis is a dangerous disease, leading to heart attacks and strokes. Normal arteries are soft, folded as easily as soft plastic tubes. In the artery wall of smooth muscle, when contraction is effective contraction blood circulation. A hardening of the arteries cannot be squeezed. Age is a major cause of arteriosclerosis. Vitamin K2 specifically keeps calcium and phosphorus from depositing into the aorta and reverses the effects of bad food on the heart. Researchers have shown that vitamin K seems to stop the calcification and hardening of blood vessels. Vitamin K is found in many leafy green leafy vegetables. People have studied and discovered many positive effects of vitamin K. Vitamin K can help prevent cancer, increase bone density, reduce cardiovascular disease, reduce varicose veins, reduce urinary disease. Street. Vitamin K plays an extremely important role in maintaining the body's secretion and insulin utilization and reduces the risk of type 2 diabetes in adults by almost 20%. However, how much vitamin K supplementation is reasonable? As we all know, vitamin K is found in many leafy green leafy vegetables, such as spinach, cabbage, kale, cauliflower, etc., which is about 90% of the vitamin K absorbed by the body. Vitamin K is also found in meat, cheese and eggs. Do not forget to supplement the source of vitamin K for your body. People who do not eat regular vegetables are at risk of vitamin deficiency because the body is capable of storing vitamin K in fat cells so you only need to consume the foods that provide it without having to consume foods rich in vitamin K every day. In case of non-vitamin K supplement, food must be taken orally. The dosage must also be prescribed by the doctor.